Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Today's gonna be a little bit weird. It's mostly gonna just be uh, this uh, one of uh, three videos a day. Um, the League of, Legends, League of Legends video that you have just seen, and then you'll have this video, and then possibly one more video today, um, but they're all gonna be sporadic. So normally how I like, usually have like an hour, hour and a half, this one will probably be a much longer in between. Um, so I'll get those three videos, I'll get at least three videos out, and then it will do the more um, I would say catching up type of deal. So that was, that's what's gonna be happening. But with this one, we have great news. This is more of an update of what's been going on. Teacher on administrative leave after uh, uh, after using students as political props in book banning skits. Yes, you're right, guys. That one teacher that you were talking about or uh, that we talked about before has been immediately removed from that school. So uh, good. That is a good thing. Um, Orange County Public Schools announced a middle school teacher would be placed on military leave after using students as a political props in TikTok videos that imply Florida schools were banning books such as di dictionaries. Howard Middle School Language at Arts teacher Ethan Hooper posted videos of skits with the students acting out that, that Florida had banned books such as di dictionaries and Harry Potter. Lips of TikTok first reported a montage of the videos. Hooper took down the videos after Florida's voice asked the district whether it was appropriate behavior for a teacher. I am appalled at the behavior and judgment of the teacher who posted the inappropriate videos using his students as political props, said Superintendent Mary Vasquez. This is, uh, this is not free speech. It is the exploitation of our students for political purposes, and it will not be tolerated in our school district. Orange, Count Orange County Public Schools media manager Michael Undruff said the district would not to would would not tolerate children being used as political pawns in the classroom. Any employee of who creates videos or other content with students in an effort to exploit them for political purposes will be immediately removed from the classroom. Place on administrative leave and swift action will be taken to per terminate employment, Olin Dorf said. The series of the videos were labeled with POVA Florida Classroom and featured the teacher having students repeat that what that they shall not read books. Books are bad and if I read it is approved by the feds. Another video was labeled problematic books as he acted out banning Harry Potter books with a, with a black boy, Wonder, and Holes. About to run up on these kids and start banning these books right away, Hooper said in the video before entering the classroom. The DeSantis administration recently announced that more than 20 Florida schools removed books in 2022-2023 school year, knowing many of them contain pornographic violence or were not appropriate for the grade level. The administration was cracked down on students being exposed to, to books with pornography, pornography and violence. Service videos have shown a school in Duval County with white bookshelves. Officials from the governor's office told Florida's Voice the administration never entertained shelves to be cleared, calling it political theater. News of Florida schools reevaluating re its books following a recent Florida law that has spread across the nation. The Florida Department of Education said it has been bad battling false money narratives that Florida is banning books across the state after a recent law required media specialists to go through approved training to brush up on Florida laws in order to approve books for classrooms and libraries. So, here's the thing that they say that they're of Paul for, you know, of all that stuff that they're talking about, right? Uh, what, in my personal opinion, I think they knew that this guy was like this or similarly to like this of that, of that matter because he brings, he's literally wearing a BLM shirt, uh, into the classroom, right? So you can't tell me that this guy is coming into the classroom wearing a BLM shirt and then saying that there is no way he's not going to be used for political pawn, the kids are not going to be used for political pawns or not placing anything of his political value onto the kids, um, so that is BS, and I don't. I think you guys are horrendously lying. I do not think that is what you guys really think. I think that you guys would have obviously allowed this to continue if this if this did not get spread. I would also believe that you got that there have been many schools that, that have been using kids as political pawns uh, for the for the most part when it comes down to, to tra transgender ideology or any of these other crazy type of things that you guys want to be pushing onto kids. So, um, I really don't think you guys are correct in this matter. I think you guys are horrendously lying. And thank God that you're actually doing something. Because Libs of TikTok actually did uh, justice tier and got them removed. And I think um, videos such as that we have made also helped. But mostly Libs of TikTok in this instance. I am not going to take away their actual victory here. Um, because uh, I, I believe that we helped by spreading the message, but ordinarily it was Libs of TikTok that actually did the most damage here, and they need to get the praise that they deserve. Well, at least there's a good thing. This guy is no longer going to be at the school, at the very least. He is removed, 
and uh, these kids will probably have a brighter future now that this guy is no longer being able to indoctrinate them and do all this other evil stuff. So, good on the school, I guess. Uh, uh, whatever they say, I guess, whiz, whatever. But at least he's gone. Um, kids are safe, and one less piece of garbage that needs to be roaming the school. All right, guys, that's it for the video. Very short one. I uh, hope you like it. Like, subscribe, share, and take care.